Der Mann des Schattens, auf der Suche nach dem Abedrachen, ist noch nicht zurückgekommen. Der Herd der Finsternis grollt. Helber, Königin der Finsternis, stellt schließlich ein Heer auf. Alperon, König des Lichts, grüßt sie. Und sie treffen sich am Fuße des Regenbogens. Die verfluchte Welle muss gemeinsam bekämpft werden. Der See von Alba brodelt. Der große Baum des Lichts fällt. Alle Macht zerfällt zu Tropfen im Tempel von Arche Köln. Wesen ohne Schatten, ihre Welt zerfällt zu nichts. Der Mann des Schattens auf der Suche nach dem Abenddrachen kehrt niemals mehr zurück. Okay, user registration is done. Now for a name. Yasuhiko's probably already there waiting for me. I'd better hurry.
I'll check my... from the real Yasuhiko. Nothing like the... Hey, in this game, I'm Orca. Regardless of what I am in reality, I'm pretty well known here. What? No, you look great. <laughs> anyway, take this. Member address is the flash mail address you can only access in the world. With flash mail, you can exchange messages with others in real time, as long as you are in the world. It's mostly used by newbies to contact other players to form a party. Try it out by inviting me to join your party. First, press the triangle button to open the menu. In the menu, select Part. Next. Choose a pl Since you just started, you probably only have my member address. Now. Ah, got it. Join my party. It's kind of weird mailing each other when we're face to face. See? My name appears under your screen. That means I'm in your party. By the way, Flash mail is only available when you're in a town. Oh, and you can't contact people when they're not... People do have a life, you know. We're not online 24-7. In other words, you can't always count on the same members to form a party. So, try to get as many member addresses as you can. You'll have more fun that way. Well, how you play is up to you. But since EXP and stuff isn't divided among party members, you really don't benefit if you go solo. Okay. Well, why don't we... This is the Chaos Gate. Sort of transfer device that takes us from one place to another. Now, press the X button. In the world, each play zone is called an area. Determined by a combination of three keywords. Select New Key... This is the keyword screen. You put the three selected keywords one by one for each part, A, B, and C. Left of the entry plate is all the keywords you have. You can collect more of them by reading your emails, the board, and from other players. Now, select good for the now. Oh, one more thing. You see the symbol on the left next to the keyword? That's the server symbol. It indicates which server you are currently logged on to. This symbol is Delta, so we're logged on to the Delta server. The list on the bottom right is the area status list. See the jewel next to the field type and dungeon? That indicates how the selected keyword affects the status. For example, check the field type. See the jewel on the right? This means that the field type is being determined by Aquafield, the keyword in C. We don't know what kind of field the current keyword will create until we get there. But once we learn the effect of that keyword, we can combine it with other keywords effectively. For more details, all right, select.
Before we get going, let me explain. During the the idea, I'll ex base. First, rotate the camera. Push either the L1 button or the R1 button to move the camera. Good. You can zoom the camera in or out by using the right analog stick. Try it. Yeah. Finally, you reset the camera by pushing the R2 button. Okay, and this is the field. It's the lowest level in the area. When you want to return to the town, press the triangle button and select Gate Out from the menu. Grassland, wilderness, and jungle are some of the field types. You can set them with keywords. The combination of field type and weather determines the area for the element now, let's get going on our quest. You see the red... By using the fairy's orb, hidden data on the map becomes visible. Like this. Yellow... Alright. the triangle button to open the menu. Okay then. Choose Rep from the lip. That's it. Pretty easy, huh? You... Okay then. Press... Next. Well, if you use it well, we can start exploring the dungeon. One thing you need to remember is that you can't gate out when you're in a dungeon. To gate out and return to the town, you have to go back to the field. The Sprite Ocarina will warp you to the surface, but you can't use it during battle. This... You... This one's booby trap. Notice a different color? Try to open it as is, and you're screwed. Just use the fortune. See? What the? Did you just see that? Yeah. Was that thing chasing her? Yeah, but... Something like that on this level?
dungeon. There are rooms with traps. The only way to get out of a trap like this is by activating all the magic. All right. This is the room where the statue is. There's only one of them at the dungeon's deepest level, and you can get rare items from it. That's enough adventure for now. If we... So we gotta... Or... was the rumor true? Take this. Huh? Please take this. There's no time. Please. What's this? A great force. The power it holds can bring forth either salvation or destruction at the whim of the user. You're... It's coming. Run! It'll kill you! What the hell? What is this? Something wrong! Nothing works!
What was wrong with Yasuhiko? Why was he upset? I wanted to ask him, but he wouldn't even pick up the phone. And then? The next day, I found out that Yasuhiko had been hospitalized. I rushed to the hospital, but they wouldn't even let me see him. But I guess it's better this way. I didn't want to see him all week, and he wouldn't want that either. But what the hell happened to him? I have a feeling that the key to it is somewhere in the world. I should post on the...